I'm going to tell you what Electrify America charging stations are doing well and what they can improve. Charging stations are set up nicely with designated parking spots. The charging stations are conveniently located by grocery stores or restaurants so you can grab a snack. A Chobani pumpkin spice. A nice digital display of charging time, charging percentage, and price. You saw right there where the price said 36 cents per kilowatt. That's great that it shows that. The problem is, is you can go somewhere else in the city and it's 52. You're talking about a 50% increase in price. Relatively, let's say your gas was $4 at one location in the city and $6 somewhere else, you would have a problem. This is an area I think Electrify needs to address to have more consistent pricing. I understand if it fluctuates a little bit, but a 50% increase is way too much. This is what it looks like in the App Store. If you want to download it, just type in Electrify America. When you're actively charging, you'll see this bar at the top. You click on that and it shows you how well your session is doing. You can press stop charge. You can see at the bottom at any time and it'll stop the charge. One great thing about the app is that it shows you where all the locations are. You can look at it from a map standpoint and you can see all the chargers around. You can click on a charging station and it'll tell you what's available. So if we were to click on this one, you can see five of the 10 are available and you can swipe down and you can see what kind of charger it is. This one charges at 150 kilowatts, 50 different kinds of style chargers. You can see that it says available, that one's in use. Also, it shows, hey, this one has reduced power and this one's not working. And you can see the different, uh, here's another one not working, another one not working. And you can see the different aspects about the charging station. The biggest issue I've found with Electrify America is that they don't fix the chargers immediately. It would be better to hire one or two more workers, get them up and running the same day, than to have people show up to use chargers that don't work and have that bad word of mouth marketing.